I'm loving the hair. Are you? I do. I really at least someone like is. It. You don't love it? <laughs> I do. I've had. I've gone. I loved it at the beginning, and then I went through a, a strange period where I wanted to shave my own head, and then now I'm out the other side, and hopefully it's going to grow into something which I love again. I think it's amazing. What did you initially think when you got this part? Did you watch the other versions, or do you like to go in blind? No, I mean, I'd watch them as, as you know, <clears throat> in a weird way, I sort of wish I could unwatch them, um, because they're amazing. Um, and I watch them just out of pure enjoyment, and I think, uh, you know, all the um, incarnation of this character have been incredible. So originally I thought I wouldn't touch it with a barge pole, um, <clears throat> and then I watched Fede's work, and, you know, there was an opportunity to meet him, and then we had this meeting where he didn't say one thing about her being an icon or her being something that she wasn't or trying to do something different or trying to change it in any way he just wants to tell this story about this this woman and um, her life and and that was it really and I was like oh no now I now I want to do it um, yeah so it was meeting him really how did Claire's name come up in your conversations when you were thinking about doing this movie or attached to doing this movie I was, was really trying to find someone that when people heard about it will go Get angry. <laughs> really? Why or not feel? I think if I make a choice and everybody goes like, "Yep, yeah, that's the right choice," I'm just making the choice that everybody else would do, and, and it feels wrong. And uh, I think with Claire, it was just I was trying to find the best actor I could have for the role, which I think is where we always have to start. And I was fascinated with her work, and I thought, well, she she has to be it. And basically, I met her and, and said, "Let's do this," and we said yes. And we did it. It is we did it like that, just like that. I read the book before seeing any of the films. I've mm -hmm. seen all the films, so of course, the girls. Um, and I will say why I loved it so much was I love having a really strong female character out there mm -hmm. because there's some, but none like Elizabeth. Mm. And do you kind of think that in this day and age, it's such an important character to have out there right now? I think that, for me, the importance of her character is less that she's a woman and more that she doesn't live her life by the prescribed rules that society puts on people. She doesn't care what anyone's sexuality is. She doesn't care what their political views are. She really couldn't care less. She knows people's guts. She's able to get on people's computers and see what they do when no one thinks they're watching. Like, she knows people and she doesn't judge them. I think that's why it's a really, she's a really important character because she's kind of... She doesn't care about what we put on the outside. She just wants to know whether you're a good person or not, really.